our worship toward God is our means of exercising God's power. We are getting to the core of this series. This is all that we were pursuing to come to. Our worship towards God is our means of exercising God's power. Our worship towards God is our means of exercising God's power. Our worship towards God means our obedience towards God. It means our obedience towards God. Another word for worship is obedience. Another word for worship is the gospel. Another word for being a worshiper is being a witness of Christ. So our acts of obedience are our means of exercising the power of God. The more we are conditioned into obedience, the more we are empowered. And the more we are obeying God, the more power we are exercising in all areas to bring forth the results. Power. Power is for doing work. One has a few. So you cannot accomplish more than your obedience. I'm saying our worship towards God is our means of exercising God's power. Let me borrow a scripture from my family altar. Now I've said worship means the gospel. The gospel means acts of obedience. Any act of obedience by a child of God is the gospel. The gospel is the witness of Christ. I want you to read Romans. The Gospel. Romans 1, 16 to 17. The Gospel de defined as worship. Or as simply acts of obedience. Read quickly. Romans chapter 1. From verse 16. For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God. I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. Amen. Why am I not ashamed? In other words, I am not ashamed of obeying God. I am not ashamed of obeying God. I am not ashamed of my acts of obedience. I'm not ashamed of being a witness of Christ. I'm not ashamed of doing God's will. Amen. To worship is also to do God's will. I have come not to do my will, but the will of him that has sent me. Amen. He's saying I have come to preach the gospel. He's saying I have come to exercise God's power Amen. on this earth. So to worship God is to do the will of God. Read. For I am not ashamed of the gospel. Every of time anybody did God's will, even in the Bible, the power of God was witnessed. Amen. Now, man, go to the Jordan River. What 
Naaman confronted with as he did that will of God as he submitted to that will of God was God's power for healing his leprosy yeah. another man Jesus tells go to Silahum when the whole world knew he's the same power comes by obedience power comes by all. go to Silahum go and wash in Silahum and you will see. Was it you will see all? You will see. And this man is simply left. You know we are complicating things. Amen. Miracles comes by a simple obedience. Amen. Amen. We enjoy God's power and they enjoy the fruitfulness of that, son, that power as sons by simple obedience. Yes. The church is complicating things. Amen. Simple. Amen. Uh, Living the simplicity of the gospel. And then you will have God working on your behalf. God taking your place everywhere. Praise the Lord. Amen. Finish. For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. Yeah. For it is the power of God to salvation. It is the power of God to salvation. For everyone who believes. Everyone who believes. What is the base of belief? The spirit who forms the kingdom. Amen. Salvation of every sinner in the kingdom. You cannot preach the gospel to save someone who is not in the kingdom. Amen. It is those who are in the kingdom who are seeing God by the spirit in them. Amen. They are discerning God. Come on, God, that is belief. That discernment of God is belief. Praise the Lord. Amen. You cannot obey a God you can't see. You can't obey unless you have the Spirit. Because by the eyes of the Spirit you see God. Amen. So your obedience is acknowledging that God is all. So He does what He has promised. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Come on. Praise the Lord. Finish. For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. Yani, do you want to see God in your business life, in your career, in your profession? There is no far you can't go. There is no height of fruitfulness that is too high Amen. for a child of God who exists in unceasing obedience. Amen. If only you can exist. And operate in unceasing of it. There is no height that is too high. Yeah. Yeah. God has not reserved himself from the obedience. With every act of obedience is there at work. Yeah. Exhibiting his power. Power, power mm -hmm. to produce results. Yeah. One has a few. Yeah. In accordance to your act of obedience. Yeah. Come on, praise the Lord. Yeah. Praise the Lord. At work on behalf of the obedient, Amen. on behalf of the obedient, the obedient play with the obedient. You are playing with God, Amen. stand against the obedient. You are standing against God. Amen. Point a finger at the obedient, you are pointing a finger at the God. Amen. And what happened to you that will happen to you. One has a few. Praise the Lord. Amen. Do you want to turn everybody around who is your enemy, God's enemy? Become obedient. Because they will deal with God's power himself. One has a few. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. To be obedient is not just to do. No. It is to have the spirit making up the person of your vessel. Amen. To have the spirit of sonship as one do. Amen. That's obedience. Amen. One has a few. Amen. Nobody can obey God except God himself. Amen. No one can obey God except God himself. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. That is why your activities of the flesh that are religious offered are few drugs. There are few drugs, one has a few. Praise the Lord. Amen. But the activities of the spirit are pleasure to God. They are worship. They are what? Worship. worship to God. One has a few. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Finished. Again, the same scripture. For I am not ashamed of the gospel. And of no Christ. one should be ashamed of obedience. Because God exists 
in our obedience. Yes. And what God does, no man does. Yes. But as a viewer, Amen. God is to us greater than anything. Yes. So we should never be ashamed to obey God. Other than as a viewer, Amen. we should not be ashamed of the opinion of the world, Ooh. of the opinion of the world. Amen. Let me appear to be Mshamba, but I am God. Amen. One man with God is a majority. Amen. One woman with God is a majority. I'm not ashamed. I don't care the apparent shame. I care to bring God along. Amen. To bring the infinite one along. Amen. To stand in my stead in that situation. Amen. I care to produce my desired result. So, Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. I care to have the fruitfulness that I have visualized. Amen. That I have visualized. The gospel is God's power. And the gospel is every act of righteousness. The gospel is every activity of the spirit. Through the material vessel of the son. The gospel is the activity of God who has taken the form of flesh. The gospel is an activity of God who has taken the form of flesh. You go to the office. You want to fit in the status quo. Let me tell you, you are devil, son or daughter, in the name of a son or daughter of God. Yes. You want to fit in the status quo. You, you don't want to be hold one out. Let me tell you, unless you are all one out among sinners, God's power cannot be at work with you. Amen. The same way it can never be at work with them. Amen. And it can't. Amen. Fit in the status quo for fit the power of God. Foolishness oh, yeah. to those who are perishing. Oh, yes. Now I don't want to appear foolish, so I fit in the status quo. Come on, praise the Lord. Yeah. When the world are doing their things, I'm there. Even when they are carrying each other on the back, in the name of what you call it, you know better. One has a view. Yes. Men and the women, they are there carrying each other. They are doing what? Team building. Team building. They are building a team with the devil. A team with, with the devil, you are there also making a team with the devil. And then you, you are saying, after this, I'll go and kneel down. Pray to God. No, you are a teammate of the devil. Teammates of the devil cannot fight God. <laughs> praise the Lord. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. To live out the gospel is to say no to the God of this world. Amen. It's to say no to the status quo of the world. Amen. Come on, it's to say no to the will of the devil. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. With the God of this world. Amen. The gospel is in conflict with the God of this world. Wow. Just like the flesh and the spirit are in conflict. Amen. Because the gospel is an activity of the spirit. But as a few. So I must distract the conflict in order to enjoy the power. Amen. I must stand the conflict in order to enjoy the power. I must be the whole one out. Amen. To be the only one with whom God is working and watching. Amen. That I may enjoy God's power. We, we, we've, we become the heads and never the tail. Because we are Lord. Amen. We are Lord. We are on our own. But as a few, our own with God. Amen. The church is borrowing too much. Paul termed it conforming to the patterns of the world. You want the um, want to be the woman that everybody in the world of your age is. You want to be the man that everybody in your company of your age is. You want to be there. Kill a kid to the dunia, the dunia. And that's why now the church has forfeited God's power. power. Forfeit obedience. Forfeit God's power. No child generation can enjoy God's power beyond the measure of its obedience. Yeah. Every child generation enjoys God's power to the measure of the obedience of the material vessels of the sons of God in that child generation. Yeah. And they cannot enjoy more than that. We are facing a disobedient church generation. Friends, I want to be obedient. Amen. I want to be obedient and advocate obedience. Amen. When I advocate obedience, then I'm granting others God's power. Amen. Come on, I'm granting others ability to exercise God's power. Amen. I'm raising a church generation eh, in which everybody is walking
saved by God's power. Finish. For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God to salvation. What is, what is gospel? Acts of obedience. Doing the will of God. Aye. Meeting God's own demand. Demands. That's the gospel. So a child of God is supposed to live out, preach the gospel 24 hours a day. And we are serving the world only when we are living out the gospel. Yeah. When we relate with them according to the gospel. When we let the spirit relate with them. Amen. Only then are we serving the world. Amen. Come on. Otherwise we are becoming partners with the devil for more captivity in the world. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Amen. And you can only walk in two powers. God's power or the devil's power. There is no man's power. One has a view. Amen. There is no man's for I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ for it is the power of God to salvation for everyone who believes it is God's power to the salvation what is salvation? a recreation salvation is a recreation recreation it is the performing of the new crea creation. Salvation is the performing of the new crea. And that is why in the Great Commission, the Bible does not say preach the gospel to all men. Yeah. Preach the gospel that the gospel may be preached to all creation. Sure. Amen. But as a few, we live out the gospel to recreate every foreign creation in the world. Amen. We live out the gospel Amen. to recreate the fallen heart. Amen. To perform new creation in the fallen heart. And upon every fallen creation. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. And you know when we do that? We are separating a heritage for the son. For the new things that are new creation belong to the new man. The things that are holy creation, they belong to the whole man. Amen. So we are plundering the devil and plundering his science. Amen. Their riches are becoming our riches. Amen. There is only one sure means of transferring yes. the wealth of the heavens to the church. Yes. It is magnifying the obedience of the church. Amen. It is magnifying the obedience of the church. Yes. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. It is having sons of God live out the God. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. The rest of the ways that are taught, they are lies. Amen. They are lies. Lies. One has a few. We transfer the world of the heavens to the church only by faith. Amen. Only by? Amen. By faith, which means obe Amen. obedience towards God. One has a few. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. Everything you will transfer, you must pass it in heaven. Not here. Amen. Not see it with the sinner. See it in heaven. Amen. And while it is in heaven. Then live out what you are seeing in heaven. Amen. You make it a new creature. Yes. And you make it your proper. Amen. One has a few. Amen. You make it the property of the son. The son. Acts 8. Acts 1 8. Acts chapter 1. Verse 8. But you shall receive power. When the Holy Spirit has come upon you. And they shall receive power. When the Holy Spirit has come upon you. In the land. Now what is The Spirit coming upon you is the Spirit coming into you. The Spirit comes in you and upon you. To make you. To effectively communicate the gospel. The Spirit who comes in you. Is the gospel. The Spirit who comes in you is the God. The spirit upon you is the ground that is conducive for sowing the gospel. Amen. The spirit upon you is the king. Come on, he's the king. Come on, he's the king. He's the king. Praise the Lord. Amen. That is the environment. That's why the gospel is salvation to everyone who believes. Everyone who believes is everyone who is in the king. But as a few, it is 
sinners in the kingdom that are believing sinners. It is sinners in the kingdom that are believing, born as a few. Malaysia. But you shall receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you. I mean to receive the Spirit in you is to receive the ability to obey God. Is to receive the ability to worship God. Is to receive the will of God which has become God in you. To receive the will of God to become God in you. Who will perform that will of God? Amen. Praise the Lord! Amen. That is receiving the Spirit into you. Now when you have received the Spirit into you, then you are brought into existing in the Spirit over you. In the Spirit over you. So anyone into whom the Spirit comes, upon that mercy of the Spirit comes. The same mercy of the Spirit that comes in you, become the same mercy of the Spirit coming upon you. What has the view? To form the kingdom. Praise the Lord. Amen. In other words, the more you have received the seed of the gospel to sow. To the same measure and dimension that you have received the seed of the gospel to sow. Come on, the ground that is conducive, the ground of heaven exists with you. Yes. Exists with and upon you. Amen. What has the view? Amen. To make there to be a conducive ground for you, for your obedience to bring forth fruit. Fruitfulness, one has a few. Of performance, you care? Creation, one has a few. Come on, praise the Lord! Let me tell you, God's power exists in the spirit who comes in you. Every son is empowered only to the measure. God has become the person of his material vessel. Every son enjoys God's power. To the measure they have become God by identity. Identity, God's power belongs to God alone. Amen. Tell the fakers in the church Amen. that God's power is no man. Just go exercise the gender you want and do anything you want. God's power is exercisable by God alone. Amen. It is God's power. It does not depart from God. But as a few, and you cannot be there where God is not at work. God's power is always manifested by God being at work. At work. That God at work is God's power. That God at work is God's power. Come on, praise the Lord. So you are empowered to the measure. You are granted the ability. That is the spirit of truth to put God into work. To work. One as a few. So that you can silence the fakers. Because we are moving beyond. Amen. To silence the fakers. Amen. One has a few. Amen. We must go for the reality. To eliminate the fake. Yes. And to make everybody see the reality. Amen. And recognize the fake. Amen. One has a few. Amen. That you may not only save the world. But you may save the sons of God. Yes. The little children of God. One has a few. Amen. But you shall receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you, and you shall be witnesses to me in Jerusalem. You shall be witnesses. What is a witness? He shall make everyone with whom you shall bring everyone with whom you relate face to face with Christ. Amen. Face to face with yes. why? You are the spirit of truth. You are the spirit of Christ. What has the view? So everybody who relates with you come face to face with Christ. So you are a witness of Christ. First high. When they see you, they are seeing Christ first high. They are seeing Christ first. Praise the Lord. Being a witness is not to stand on a platform and preach a very big gospel. No. If you are not bringing people eye to eye with Christ, then you are not a witness. Neither are you a hair of God's power. Power. One has a view. Praise the Lord. Shall be my witnesses. And, then, and you shall be witnesses to me yeah. in Jerusalem. Tell me, God's power is the living word of God in us. Is the living word of God that has become God in us. In us. Amen. That's the power God has granted us. Hallelujah. God grants us his power by speaking into us. 
and finding a way to become the person of our material man. Yes. Mercy one as a few. Yes. So that we are him in every way and we are enjoying every quality of God. Yes. The man, the quality of God is God's power. Power! power. power. Oh. Yes. The infiniteness of God oh, yes. is the mother quality of God. Yes. Praise the Lord! And you shall be witnesses to me in Jerusalem and in all Judea and Amen. Samaria. <laughs> what is Christ doing? Exactly what the Bible says. This gospel is a reality. Look, a seed of wheat must fall down and die. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yes. To then what Jesus did, and why he went back to heaven, he wanted to die at the mountain. Amen. He never wanted just to have a spirit inside some vessels, like the Old Testament, and they go out. No. He wanted to multiply in many others. So those in whom Christ has multiplied, come on, those in whom the spirit of Christ, same spirit that was in Christ here, exists. They are witnesses. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. Wherever they are, they are first eyewitness of Christ. Yes. Everyone who meets them, confront with Christ, high to high. Amen. And enjoy God's power. Oh. Come on, praise the Lord. Yeah. And have the same power of the gospel that Christ exercised, exercised in them. Yes. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Every situation that confronts with the us in whom Christ has multiplied. Yes. Come on, praise the Lord. Yes. Comes face to face with Christ. Right. Come on, praise the Lord. Yes. I am saying we must move to seek the Spirit. Amen. We must attract the Spirit. We must pray like we want to die. Yes. That the leprous man may come again face to face with Christ. Yes. Come on, that the barren may come face to face with Christ. That the heart of God's kings may come face to face with Christ right. to be called foxes. foxes. Why not? Because he alone can call them foxes. Amen. Why not? As if you without suffering the consequences. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. This world, we have been given the opportunity, church. Now, this is where I find the church of Jesus, the present church, will be the most foolish, yes. most ignorant. Yes. I think we are not worthy the salvation of God. Oh. Because when you are born again, you have been granted opportunity to bring Christ back into the streets, your village, come on, your neighborhood, everywhere in your place of work. You have been given opportunity that the Peters of the day that have not been able to catch fish can again meet this man. Come on. Praise the Lord. Amen. You have been given an opportunity that those who need wine, not even those who need to begin even a wine business Amen. without capital Amen. for the sake of the glory of God. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Can I tell you something? There is no child of God unless he lacks power. Who can lack what he needs to execute what God demands of them? Yes. No one can get capital. No child of God should lack her. Our capital does not come from the banks. It comes from God. It is God that we look upon for all things. That is the essence of being a son. Come on, praise the Lord. God, who is our sonship, comes on himself. There is no bigger man than God, who is our sonship, that he can count on. Praise the Lord. the bank. The lending is very heavy. There is no money in the bank. So, you know, I'm going to be a to be a shadow. I'm a man. 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 I'm a
Anybody letting with you is letting any situation letting me, even that of need of capital. If that situation is less with God, then God asks the whole world. God asks the whole world. Everything in this world is a means. Come on, praise the Lord. But you shall receive power when the Holy Spirit has come oh, upon another, you. Another name for power is God's enablement. Expression for power is God's enablement. He shall be God enabled. God comes in you in the form of the Spirit of Truth to enable you. God comes in you in the form of the Spirit of Truth to make you enjoy His own ability. abilities. When you are enjoying God's abilities, you see, you are enjoying God's power. Enforce them. No! The direction of the king are already reinforced 
by the authority and the position of that king. Yes. Praise the Lord! Yes. Um, every measure of the spirit that has come in you is God's position that you have been meant to occupy. It's God's kingship position you have been meant to occupy. The more the spirit increases, the more you are taken higher to occupy a more higher ranking of God. Oh God, born as a few. Come on, praise the Lord! And the more your actions are becoming more fruit, fruitful, born as a few. But the more your actions are becoming more. Praise the Lord. Amen. Do you know we can all be in a certain situation, but reap differently? Let me tell you. Your actions exhibit the authority and the power of the God that you are. The power of God that you are. Who you have. Amen. Aye. Nime evil kill action. It's like the action of a chief. Same action of root. The same. No. Will carry the same power? No. no. The one of root has come from state house. It will exhibit the power of that office. Office. A child of God is here. A toddler. A milk taker. They are obedient, yes. In business. What has the view? Manifesting obedient, yes. But now they are lacking God's power. What has the view? I mean they are not grown up, they are babies. They are baby God. They are baby God. God. Not God. They are baby God. But as if you Amen. come up with the Lord, Amen. every measure of the truth that is not in you, that is a measure of God's power forfeited in every action and activity in your life. Amen. That's a measure of God's power forfeited. And I'll show you why. Can I get four people here? Three rankings. What are the my rankings? Now, I'm a child of God. I want two children of God. Come here, two children. Oh, that. 
three rankings as a subject. So, hi, kuja, just what name? Kuja. Nendo kipaji pole pole.
But as a viewer, Amen. you are bringing those situations eye to eye with the Christ who you are. You are. But as a viewer, so when I want to go to Toro, when I pick up my goat, what? When I go fruitful. When I want to pick me. Can I even yes? Can I treat the basic? Ah, Maraki singing in the back here was messed with the same other scene. Six key. See, the only reason I want to form the kingdom. That situation is against the word temptation. Temptations because they still remain the kingdom of God. Darkness one has a few. Praise the Lord! See, the God, as I don't know what temptation is, it's about fruitfulness. When they be your fruitfulness, no! That is the mess even your shamba will dry. Hata, in your foot of a panda pale, I'm a devil with a drop. It's a dry one has a few. Aya, what is the doctor? Praise the Lord. I don't know one. Growth is not optional. Spiritual growth. Wake up. Down. I've decided to go to be effective, to make you grow. Amen. But you have to choose to grow. One has a few. Growth is not the only thing that will eliminate the impact of opposition of the darkness upon you. It's spiritual growth. Not failure to see spiritual growth. Spiritual Even a devil that cannot make you sin will not make you sin. We will resist your fruitful. I am a listen. Because that is a ground you cannot sow. So that is an authority of the kingdom that is not there. There. And that is truth that is not in. But as a few. So can you produce? See you shall keep power see you. Power is the ability to sow. And the conducive ground, availability of the conducive ground for sow. So we in the kingdom of your formation. Praise in the sun you are in the kingdom of your formation. Praise the Lord. Amen. That's power. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm saying power is the ability to sow. That is the seed of truth that is in you. Plus the kingdom that relates to that truth that is around you. That's where power is. Those two, when they make love, they produce power. power. Come on, praise the Lord. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Yeah. That's all the truth, you know. Come on, the truth kingdom, Akun. So that environment, come on, here, get the kingdom. Here, the situation. Akun, the kingdom. Now that is the kingdom of darkness. So there you can't read it. One has a few. You can only read by worshiping the devil. The devil, one has a few. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Come on, praise the Lord. Yeah. Malice. But you shall receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you, and you shall be witnesses to me in Jerusalem and in all Judea. You Judea. shall be witnesses. So you will have people come eye to eye with Christ. Right. So it means the Spirit you are receiving in yourself is Christ. Amen. The Spirit you are receiving in yourself is Christ who is replacing the physical man. man. One has a few. So that those who are meeting the physical man eye to eye, they are meeting with Christ eye to eye in your material vessel. Praise the Lord! Yeah. Now that Christ is the one who exercises power. Power! Because the power is the power of God. And it's only the Son of God is God. God, God one has a few. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord! Amen. Let me tell you, as long as you have not grown, you are wanting in growth, you will be wanting in obedience. Amen. As long as you are wanting in growth, you must be wanting in obedience. Amen. And we are saying it is obedience that is the master key for unlocking power. Amen. Obedience is the master key for unlocking power. Oh. power. So there is a measure of God's power you will not unlock through your actions and activity. 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 So a measure of God's fruitful, ordained fruitfulness that you will never reap. You will never reap. One has a few. And those are the things you remain to want. You remain to want. Malice. And the devil now comes to use them as a tool to bring you down. Yeah. Hi, Malice. And you shall be witnesses to me in Jerusalem and in all Judea. Let me tell you, I will take you to the Old Testament. Everybody who had the word of God, instruction, and did, I'm telling you, they had such overwhelming results. Just that. Great wars like Jericho came down simply because some men have had the word of God and they have done. 
on earth in form of the worship of God or the Son of God. That it is God who exists on earth in form of the Son, whose actions and activities are worship to the God in heaven. That it is God who exists on earth in form of the Son, whose actions and activities are worship to the God in heaven. Thus it is God who exists on earth in form of the Son whose actions and activities are worship to the God in heaven. Now when we say the actions and activities are worship, we are saying they are means of exercising God's power. power. They are means of exercising God's power. power. So to the measure we are worshippers, we are reservoirs of God's power. We perform all good things to that measure by God's power. Oh. Amen. Right, go to your scripture. Israel is at the fall of Jericho. I don't want us to begin far. To begin, just read the instructions you were given and then read the execution. Bus, only those two. Joshua chapter 6, Joshua verse 1. Chapter 6, verse 1. Now Jericho was securely shut up mm -hmm. because of the children of Israel. Mm -hmm. None went out and none came in. Mm -hmm. And the Lord said to Joshua, mm -hmm. See, I have given Jericho into your hands. You see, now there is a word proceeding from the mouth of God. Proceeding from God in heaven. 
Hallelujah. That's the way it proceeds out of from God into you. Into me. When you are praying, one has a few. That is in your case, the spirit of truth. The spirit of truth. See, I have given Jericho into your hand. Because the instruction of God becomes your ability to obey. 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 God does not instruct you without giving you his spirit. His spirit. It's even in the Old Testament. Whenever he instructed them, he gave them his spirit. spirit. I have given Jericho into your hand, its king, and the mighty men. And let me tell you, those are the words of God. Over every area, over we all spirit, over every area, all spirit of truth, God has given to you. When he's giving you that spirit of truth, he's saying, I have given this Jericho. Amen. God has given you every situation and every area. Amen. Come on, oh spirit of truth, he has granted you. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. Because that spirit of truth is God, yes. who has come to take your place over that situation and with God, nothing is impossible. Amen. God is a He's giving you the spirit and he's saying, I've given you that. I've given you that business. I've given you that career. Amen. I've given you that marriage. Amen. I have given you that money. Amen. I have given you that job. Amen. One has a few. Praise the Lord. Amen. Because the God who has given you is the God who is working with you in the area where he has given. It's God who will be working with, with me. With you. So that you can instruct to give by the same word he has given. Even me. He has given you one as a few. Yeah. That word can find a conducive ground to sow. So. That ground is God who is accompanying the sun. The sun. Praise the Lord. Yeah. See, I have given Jericho into your hand. It's key and the mighty men of valor. You shall march around the city. Now let me ask you. After you are given the spirit of truth, what is the meaning? Only act of obedience. Yes. Um, which is also not your activity. Yes. It's the activity of the spirit, of the word that has been spoken into you. Yes. But as a few, yes. sit down. Yes. So you have already. Because what is remaining is the action of faith. Action of the spirit. And that spirit is already in you. To the measure you have been given Jericho. Amen. What has it been? Amen. To the measure you have been given your Jericho. Amen. Jericho is one as a few. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Yeah. In other words, God is like saying, I have given you under these terms and conditions. If you fulfill them, I will be there to bring Jericho down. Amen. If you fulfill them, that is my perfect will. will. Perfect? It will put me at work to bring down Jack. Jericho. Jericho. Come on, praise the Lord. Anytime we face a situation and perform the perfect will of God, that is the end of that situation. Amen. That is the end of that situation. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. We have already put God into work to perform a new creation. Creation one has a view. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. And I'm not down. I'm wondering where you got your down. Finish. You shall march around the city, all you men of war. Then the honor. How are they were carefully listening? Said you. But they received the spirit to exercise them. In the hobby. Obedience. Obedience. Where were you need only to receive the spirit? Because the spirit becomes you. And it becomes the one to that demand has been addressed. It becomes the truth of that demand in you. And it becomes you the executor of that demand. Amen. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. I expect a New Testament believer to go around the Jericho more perfectly. Kill a great you are here. Kill a great you are here. Hata masai kuja kutimia ile ya Mungu tu pa. Bwana asifiwe. Ile kwa the mind of God. Praise the Lord. Because that mind of God you are. That God you are. Come on, praise the Lord. 
expected perfect obedience from these guys. Oh, yes. But he expects from you. Yeah. That's why the Bible says that unless our righteousness surpasses that of the Pharisees, one has a few, we shall never enter the king. Praise the Lord! Yeah. Because you become God. You don't become God. When I'm talking about spiritual growth, I'm saying make sure you grow the God that you are. Grow the God that you are, that you may eliminate the physical man that it be being born as a few. Because the physical man is limited, but the God you are is unlimited. So when you are growing the God that you are, you are eliminating your limiter. You are eliminating your existing limiter. Praise the Lord! Your limitations are non existence only to the measure of God enabled. Only to the measure of God and eh? only to the measure of the spirit of truth exists in a new one as a few. Praise the Lord. And you shall march around the city, all you men of war. You shall go all around the city once. This you shall do six days. That's the one God speaks into you as you pray and receive the Spirit. He is speaking those words. He is telling you his instruction for taking over every city, city every year. Jericho. One has a few. If only you can do the will of God, God can be there perform. Performing one has a few. God can be there perform. Because that will of God you are sowing into God. Who is forming the kingdom and accompanying you in that strength? But as if you, when you sow your, your will into God, then you put God into what? You bring God into obligation. God is subject to his will. His will, but as if you, when you put him into what? Then God's power is there exercised. Huh? To bring forth the result. And seven priests shall bear seven trumpets of ram's horns before the ark. But the seventh day, you shall march around the city seven times, and the priest shall blow the trumpets. It shall come to pass, when they make a long blast with the ram's horn, and when you hear the sound of the trumpet, that all the people shall shout with a great shout, then the wall of the city will fall down flat. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying the word of God that is in you is not only God's direction that we are going to go. But there you have the results. Amen. That in that word God has promote, pronounced the result. No wonder your faith is sees things that are not as if they were. Amen. Praise the Lord! Amen. You see Jericho down when Jericho is still standing. Yes. You see your situation ended when it is still there. Yes. Come on, that is fair. Come on, praise the Lord! In me in form of spirit of truth. Truth one has a few. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. That spirit of truth is faith. Amen. By that spirit, I see God's mind intent. Because I have the mind of God. Amen. I see as does God. Because God has already seen Jericho fall. Fall. I too I have seen it fall. But as if you were, I too have seen it fall. Praise the Lord. Amen. So my Jericho is down immediately. Establish faith. Amen. Immediately I've tried the spirit of truth that lets the most is true. My Jericho is down. No. Come on, my situation has come to an end hey. in my mouth. Mind. So all situation ends. All are changed, all eliminated in the mind. Amen. Before they are changed in the physical. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. So when I'm granted God's power, when I'm made a reserve of God's power, then to that measure of my power, my Jericho's are down. Down in my mind, what has it feel? Praise the Lord! Amen. Because that power is the mind of God. Mind of God, what has it feel? Amen. So I'm seen as does God. What God saw happen and He has declared to me, I have seen it happen. What has it feel? Let me tell you something. Those guys that are going around Jericho, they have no trace of fear. Yes. Yes. I'm telling you they are full of triumph, full of confidence. Yes. They are only seeing Jericho down. Yes. Every round they are going, they are looking, oh, 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 is it coming down? Ah, because it is down. Ah, it is down. I'm not, can I enter now? Can I enter? Can I enter? Ah, thank you. Ah, I want to see you. I'm going to you around. Can I enter? Can I enter? How do you get to the point? I don't know. What does it feel? Someone on the killer, Jericho, who? What does 
has been filled. So your situation is over. Immediately you have received the spirit of truth. Immediately you are God empowered. Your situation is, is over. Do you know why? Because you are occupying the position of God before that situation. You are occupying God's position before that situation. Praise the Lord. And there exists no that such situation before God. Praise the Lord. So you are seeing us as God. That your situation is not there. These guys who are given what? They are built to worship. They are built to obey God. When God spoke those words, the spirit of those words came upon them. Came upon and became the ability to obey. They are built to do that will of God. Praise the Lord. So they are not facing Jericho. God is facing Jericho through them. And to the message you have received the spirit of truth, God is facing your situations through your material body. God is facing your business life through your material body. God is facing your marriage through your breaking marriage through your material body. Come on, God is facing your financial crisis through your material body. And now, if it is wrestling with God, it is all. Come on, it is all. Praise the Lord. So we arrive by faith. We receive the results first by faith. By faith. By faith. And the results that you don't have by faith, forget. They are not yours. Because God is not there. They are one as a few. You still have limited. Your limitations one as a few. The results I have received by faith are evident of the elimination of my limiter. My limitations one as a few. Why I'm seeing it, it has happened. It's because it's the unlimited God in me in the place of the limited physical man. So to that measure, my limitations are limited. Yes. Praise the Lord! Amen. Malice. And when you to be hear... granted God's power is to be granted God's own ability to produce results. Is to be granted God's own ability to produce results. Results. One has a few. How huh? It has to do with God coming in you to become the person producing results. Results in all areas of your life. And that's the privilege of a child of God that I'm seeing it has been forsaken. That is our privilege. So that when the world are toiling by their own limited man, God is in us toiling on our behalf. God is in us facing the situations on our behalf. God is in us running the business on our behalf. Praise the Lord! The greatest empires on this earth should belong to the children of God. Should belong to the second Adam. Praise the Lord! And when you hear the sound of the trumpet, that all the people shall shout with a great shout, then the wall of the city will fall down flat, and the people shall go up. They have not been told to do anything else when you hear Turkey James. No, there is no more laboring. Because I'm not there. Am I there? To the measure I'm God's empowered, I'm God's enabled, God has taken my place. I'm not there. So you cannot tell me now do something. Now to go to the idea. What has the view? Can he tell me that? No. What has the view? So if you are operating by faith, there is nothing you have to do. There is nothing you have to, to do. Even the actions are not yours. They are the spirit of truth. What has the view? They are of your spirit of sonship. Praise the Lord. So in the militia, immediately these guys add that word. Yeah? Immediately they add, they were relieved of the responsibility of bringing down Jericho. Yeah. You know why? Do you know no man can obey God? Yeah. Even Noah could not build the ark. Yeah. Exactly the way it was in the mind of God. No one raised a pattern of God except the Spirit of God. Yeah. What does it feel? Yeah. So when they were going around, you think that was me? No. no. Immediately when God commands, God finds a way to be at work mm. to execute the commands. Amen. Faith is God in us to execute the command. And so in the Old Testament, he found a way to them to execute the command. Command one as a few. So it's the spirit who is running in and with every man around Jericho. No wonder they are running around such a thing for so long. But when times comes to shout, they can also shout to the highest. One as a few. They are not tired. Tired. One as a few. When we receive the spirit of God and the instruction of God to obey, we operate by grace. 
we operate by prayer, which is God in us operating over there. Praise the Lord. Come on, praise the Lord. So we feel what God can feel over that operation. Operation, if God are not tired, will not tire one as a few. Praise the Lord. Are we not supposed to operate by grace? Yeah. To operate by God's power is to operate by the grace of God. Amen. Um, yes. The grace of God here is the spirit of, spirit of God. The spirit of truth. Amen. It is the spirit we have received who attains all things. Who executes the demands of God and attains all things on our behalf in the areas that relate to that spirit of truth. One has a view. Now that's privilege. Great one. Children of God. Yeah. That God is here knocking. And he's saying, if you open, I'll come and dine with. What is dining? I'll become a participant. I'll come and dine with you. I'll come and take your place. Yes. Yes. And the people shall go up, every man straight before him. That's great. That is what. Then verse 11. So he had the ark of the Lord circle, circle the city, going around it once. Then they came into the camp and lodged in the camp. And Joshua rose early in the morning, and the priest took up the ark of the Lord. Then seven priests bearing seven trumpets of ram horns before the ark of the Lord went on continually. Read quickly and blew with their trumpets, and the armed men went before them. But the rear guard came after the ark of the Lord, while the priests continued blowing the trumpets. And the, and the second day they marched around the city once, and, and returned to the camp. So they did six days. Mm -hmm. And it came to pass on the seventh day. On the seventh day! Yeah. Allah, yes. On the perfection of the obedience. The day of perfect will be. The day that represents perfect will be. In other words, for us to have the God's promised results, we must manifest perfect obedience. Perfect. Born as a few. Do you think these guys are not in opposition? Do you think they are not in opposition? They have the spirit of God. But the spirit of the Jericho's, of the devil, is he not there? He's there. They are under opposition. Praise the Lord! But they have chosen to obey God under opposition. Under opposition. And why they can obey is because they have the Spirit of God. The Spirit of God cannot be successfully opposed by the devil. Come on, praise the Lord! We end the effectiveness of opposition upon us when we have received the Spirit that leads to that situation. But as a few, it is by receiving the Spirit that leads to that situation that we make opposition an effect. We become the house built on the road. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. That empowers us to continue obeying in the ministry of opposite until we bring forth the results. But it came to pass on the seventh day that they arose early about the dawning of the day and marched around the city seven times. Seven times. In the same manner. On that day, only they marched around the city seven times. Mm. And the seventh time, it happened when the priest blew the trumpets that Joshua said to the people, Shout, for the Lord has given you the city. Ah! Just the way he said. They are just obeying the word. They are doing exactly what God said. They are like cartoons of God. They are like cartoons of God. Praise the Lord! Cartoons of the Spirit. Praise the Lord! Faith makes us cartoons of the spirit. Um, yeah. Bouncing things that you don't know what they are doing, but the spirit alone knows what is. What has the view? Praise the Lord! Amen. What is it? Verse 20. So the people shouted when the priest blew the trumpet. And it happened when the people heard the sound of the trumpet. And the people shouted with a great shout that the wall fell down flat. The wall fell down! Which man went for the war? Who went for the war? God went for the war. So our acts of obedience puts God into work. When we obey God perfectly, the 
and we put into what? Fullness of God's power. Power, power to produce results. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. Jericho is God. A big city. Come on, give me a dunia. One game now for several nations. Because I didn't. Kupiga wa mfalu menakulete yo seti chi. Chi. Sasa go, our God is different. He does not do that. One has a female. He's only demanding obedience. Obedience that every Jericho in your life will be down. Whether it's a captivity within or anything happening in an area of your life. It requires only obedience. Obedience one has a few. And when you manifest acts of obedience, then you are put God's power into work. Into work one has a few. Praise the Lord! I am a listener. Then the people went up into the city, every man straight before him, and they took the city, and they utterly destroyed all that was in the city. They utterly destroyed all that was in the city. Mm. Why were those men even not powerful? Even those who never died. Because they were dealing with God. Who would have power more than the power of God? Come on, praise the Lord! And when you see the victories of Israel, whenever God instructed, they went and did exactly. They defeated big nations than themselves. Look at the case of Joshua. part. God is saying, please take the singers. Put them in front. Remove the soldiers. Come on, praise the Lord. We don't need the trained soldiers. We need the soldiers with the skill of the Spirit. The soldiers with the skill. That's what God is saying. Praise the Lord. We don't need soldiers that have the skill of men. They are limited. But the skill of the spirit is a lead. So let the singers go ahead. Because when God has said, let the singers, he has made the singers skilled. He has given those singers the spirit. Come on, praise the Lord. Those singers will sing by the spirit. And when they sing the word of God, that's obedience. Obedience. They will put the spirit who is in that environment into work. To accomplish according to the word of God. So that those men will slaughter each other. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. Now to just but it happened exactly. exactly. Come on, praise the Lord. Amen. Children of God are not supposed to toil. They are supposed to simply obey. 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 One has a few. And then the power of God is there to toil on their behalf. On their behalf, one has a few. Praise the Lord. Amen. And many others in the Bible. Crown of victories that were won simply by obey. Every victory in the Bible was won by Obi. Obedient. One has a few. Praise the Lord. Doubt, David. All the wives are gone. The case of Ziegler. Ziegler. One has a few. Go and read. All the wives of the big men and everyone is gone. David is here crying. God is saying, Layesa, run after them. You will overtake them. Send you. And they bestow everything here. Aye. But you know what happened? Immediately God said that. The spirit of those words came upon David. David was not to go. No. God had created another soldier. Called the spirit of the sun. But as a few, God had become the soldier now in death. And then he had to go. The only David had to go to the spirit of the spirit of the sun. But as a few. Spirit of the sun. It was God's power. Empower. But as a few. Imagine what look at a man's son. I made that machine and I'm going to overtake. When I see him, I had a speed of move. When you go and say that I'm going to overtake, when you move, I had a speed of that I overtake. Yes. So I'm going to have to go your vessel. Yes. Pa, pa. So when we are in the spirit, we labor at God's own speed Amen. to attain the God's ordained results at God's timing. 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 One has a few. Praise the Lord. Amen. And we attain exact. Exactly. exactly. As God has, has, has promised, promised one as a few. So, you would have never David and I can be. And I've given it at a swan like West Virginia. At a donkey, at a donkey, donkey. And I look at the Maruka moon. I kind of got Wafika Bell, Wakiangani. Wakaon at the power of God at work. I can't wait to get it. I can't one has a few. The same way with the lady. And Baal's prophet. And then they are wondering, but Baal's one. Is that a man? Is it a man? Have you ever seen 400 
versus one man. Umeona hivi? Na watu wameshindwa kiona. Wanaangalia tu, wanashindwa. Na wewe ndio kama kombe. Na wewe ndio kama kombe. That must be God. Bwana azifiwe. Because Elijah was under God's instruction. Come on, praise the Lord. We need only to be God's instructed. Now, the mother means of receiving God's instruction is prayer. Prayer is our mother means of receiving God's instruction. And God's power. Power, Bwana azifiwe. Prayer is about our mother means of receiving God's instruction and God's power. God's power. Praise the Lord. Amen. Si upata, uone maisha ikibadilika. Na uone picha yako ikiwa parada. Paradise. Utiwache yangu tu unaona wivu. Sababu yangu itakuwa paradise. Amen. Yangu soon. Amen. It will be paradise. Amen. I will have all that I need. Amen. To do what God wants me to do. Bwana has a few. Because I'm obedient. Uh, obvious. Bwana has a few. So will you be obedient with me? And now that cannot be fixed. Will you toil the same toil I did to receive the same spirit? Spirit, one as a few. So that as God rewards me, you will find another one rewardable? Rewardable in you, one as a few.